Well, Josh, tell us, the pre-season's concluded. Um, how much have you learned over the pre-season and uh, especially under Clarkson? Yeah, I think Clarko has been massive for the group at the moment. We learn heaps with the new, new um, sort of structure and new game plan that we're doing. But yeah, even with positioning wise and the things that he wants, his, uh, your role and knowing that, he's been really clear and learning from him has been pretty easy. But yeah, learning a lot and um, it's been really good. Where do you see your best position on the field? Yeah, at the moment been playing predominantly down back, half back as a rebounding defender this, this pre-season and a bit of wing, so yeah, I think a mixture of half back and wing at the moment is probably my best position with um, being able to take on the game and also like being an intercept and running type of player, so yeah, I think those are my best positions at the moment. And talking about taking on the game, we've seen you peel off some pretty creative kicks. Are you given a license to do that or is that something that just comes instinctively? Yeah, I think it's a bit of both, like teammates around me and coaches really want me to back myself in with um, so yeah, taking on the game, if that's running and taking on my kicks as well, because I think they back me in as, that, as one of my weapons, so I just try to take on the game when I can. On the weekend, you caught Caleb Daniel on a pretty good tackle. Can you walk us through that one? Yeah, I was on the wing at the, at the time, and um, yeah, I thought with one of our uh, principals with defence, and it's just coming forward, so he sort of played on, and I thought, yeah, just corral him a little bit, and then, yeah, he tried to take on the game, so I thought I'd just sort of press forward, and yeah, lucky enough, stuck the tackle, and, Got to keep the goal, but yeah, it was, it was pretty good. And for those that don't know, you're a big North Melbourne fan growing up. Um, you're wearing the number 31 on your back. Do you know the significance of that number here at the club? Yeah, 31's a pretty, pretty big number with Corey McKernan wearing it. He's obviously a champion player for the club. And um, yeah, it's definitely pretty special to wear that number and see the names that are on your locker when you, when you walk into the locker room every day.